Hi, today let's have a quick look at some new decals from Life Like Decals on the KI-61. Right, so this is Paul and from Model Builder International and we'll have a look at these uh, decals from Life Like. As I said, uh, they're 148 scale. Uh, Kawasaki KI-61 part 1, so there's obviously more to come. Uh, and there's four options in here. So let's open the bag and see what we get. So what we have is one decal sheet and two single-sided pieces of paper, or sheets of paper. So let's have a look at the decal sheet to start with. You can see it's roughly about the size of your hand. Extra little bit at the bottom with looks like a couple of kill markings. That's been uh, a little bit of tape holding that on at the bottom just so you don't lose it. Uh, one thing I would say I like Life Flag put them in a, should say a decent sized bag so you're not having to bend the decal sheet to get it out the bag. Um, so there's decals. Uh, I've scanned these. And what I'll do is I'll put them up right now and just move it from top to bottom across the screen. Um, I've had a close look at these and the backing film is negligible to non-existent. Um, you'll see there is some backing film somewhere in certain places holding, should we say, sets of things together um, where you'd never get them lined up otherwise. But other than that, their decals are really nice, very fine. They react well with all the usual um, uh, setting solutions. So there's definitely problem there, printed by Microscale in the USA, which is one of their usual uh, printers. Okay, so let's look at the information on the two sheets. And again, what I'll do is I'll, put, uh, I'll scan these and put them both on the website so you can have a look at them in higher resolution. But the main thing I'll say about Lifelike is their attention to detail and the research they do. As you can see here, there is uh, 15 different books they've gone to to look up this information. And uh, there's also interviews involved with, with some of these as well. And as you can see, there's uh, four options recommended for the Hasegawa KI-61. This one just shows you the common markings. Um, templates and stencils, usual, the usual things that are the same on all of them. Um, and was it two of them are in uh, natural metal, uh, one's natural metal with a green model on top and one is basically all green. And this is where all the detail comes in. As they go through each one, they'll go through all the references. Um, in fact, I'll put this up on this one up on the screen now and just go top to bottom on it. Um, so you can pause and have a read if you want to, or you can go to the website and download, uh, have a look at the images on there. But they go into an awful lot of detail um, of exactly where they got the information from to know that what they're doing here is as good as um, anything anybody could come up with. Um, that's one of the main things I really like about them. Um, also on the front sheet, they also give an email address. If you ever have any problems or um, have more information on something, you can email them. Um, so as you can see, there's lots of information about each one. Um, they explain um, why the markings are the way they, they are. And, and for a lot of them, I believe in the first one, we can also do... Um, uh, things. I think I seem to remember reading that there's an option there to change something in there to make it the same aircraft at a different time. So, all in all, as always, lifelike decals are very impressive. Um, they're very nice decals, well researched, and should be a real pleasure to work with. Uh, many thanks for to lifelike decals for sending them along. Um, basically every decal sheet of theirs I've looked at has always been pretty impressive and like I said I love the attention to detail that they go to and just making it easy for you. Uh, don't forget to subscribe to the videos.